Today, we are going to show you how to assemble all the parts and accessories for Amigo Secrets Soft Ice Cream Machine. Before we start, please note that for every set of machine, it comes with a complete set of wear and tear spare parts and instruction manual, and these would be placed inside the machine's hopper before the delivery. Now, let's take a look at all the parts of the machine and how they would be assembled. These are the lids for the hoppers. These are the air tubes and the O-rings for each of the tubes. Each air tube is made up of inner tube and outer tube. The O-ring would be inserted into the groove on the outer tube. These are beaters, which are going to be inserted into the freezing tank and these are the two gaskets for the beaters. I will show you how to assemble them later. And these are the component parts for the freezer door. The main parts are the freezer door, the draw valves, and the handles. The star-shaped caps would be inserted at the bottom of the freezer door. These are agitators to be placed in the machine's hoppers and they are made of stainless steel 304 material. And this is the L-pin. It is for fixing up the handles on the freezer door. This is the ice cream leakage holder. It would be hooked to the two tiny pins provided on the machine. This is the approved food grade lubricant. It would be used to lubricate the O-rings for the draw valves and the freezer door. Now, please watch how the parts are being assembled. We would first assemble the air tubes. Please note that there are four types of scale on the tube, namely 1, 2, 3, and 4. The purpose of the scale is to control the speed of the flow of the ice cream mix so that the air expansion level is varied. When it is on scale 1, the hole will be the smallest, making the flow to be the slowest, and thus the highest the expansion level. Now, let's put the two rings into each of the tubes. Please take note that we don't need to apply any lubricant on it for this. Find the right way to put the rings on it and repeat the same procedure for the other tube. Now, we would assemble the beaters. The beaters are made of stainless steel and high-quality silica gel, which is stronger and easier to maintain. When inserting the gasket on the beater, the thicker side of the gasket goes in first. Therefore, slowly rotate it and push it in. Third, let's assemble the freezing door. First, put the two O-rings on each of the draw valves. You would find the left and right draw valves are the same, while the central draw valve is different. Accordingly, the O-rings for the left and right draw valves are the same, when there is a special gasket H-ring for the center draw valve. To put on the rings, Simply place them on the grooves of the draw valves. The purpose of these rings is to prevent the ice cream mix from spilling and leaking. After putting on the rings, we need to apply the approved food grade lubricant on them in order to reduce the friction between the draw valves and the freezer door. Three. 
for the central draw valve. Put on the O-ring first before inserting the H-ring. Apply some lubricant and follow the groove on the draw valve and make sure the ring is properly inserted. Now, let's put up the star-shaped caps on the bottom of the freezer door. There are O-rings to go with each of them and they must be inserted tight fit into the caps. Please take note that the caps need to be cleaned thoroughly to avoid any ice cream residual remains inside the caps. Push hard to snap the star-shaped caps on the bottom of the freezer door. There are two grooves on the freezer door for the two large O-rings. The O-rings are to help reduce the friction between the freezer door and the beaters. You do not have to apply the lubricant on these O-rings. Now, let's assemble the draw valves on the freezer door. We need to apply some lubricant on the draw valves now. Put all the draw valves inside the respective host on the freezer door and then install the handles to the draw valves by slotting through the L-pin. Check the freezer door is complete with the O-rings, draw valves, handles, and the star-shaped caps. The four pieces of hand screws here are used to fix the freezer door on the ice cream machine. Now, let's take a look at the agitators. The agitators help to blend the ice cream mix more evenly inside the hopper. For normal machines, the agitators are not available unless special request is made. Finally, this is the ice cream mix leakage holder and look for the two pins on the machine and put it on. That's all about the assembly of the machine parts. We hope you find this video helpful and thank you for watching. For more information about Amigo Secrets soft ice cream machines, please visit www.amigosecret.com.